Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the views so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam. What's with going on, guys? Welcome back to another beer review. Good Friday share in full effect. We are having a good time. Good times on Good Friday. Uh, really, really excited about this beer. This is a bucket list beer for me. Uh, from New England Brewing Company, Fuzzy Baby Ducks. This can art is amazing, by the way. This unicorn's like pooping a rainbow onto a duck and all kinds of <laughs> crazy stuff. Um, this has been a beer that's been draft only forever and people would trade for growlers of it and it was just going for insane amounts so I was never able to get it. Um, huge thanks to my man Jordan for hooking this one up. We did a little beer trade. Uh, this is a 6.2% alcohol by volume. It's an India Pale Ale and it's 100% citra hopped. And it is brewed Woodbridge, Connecticut. Brewed and canned in New England Brewing Company. I think this is the first time they've canned this beer. Um, this beer is probably three weeks-ish old, I think. Um, I actually shared a can of this with my brother-in-law last weekend. My little sister got engaged and we brought a bunch of beers because we knew it was happening and she didn't. And this is one of them. I got two cans of this, so I wanted to share one and then I wanted to review one. Um, truth be told, when I shared this, we had been drinking for a little bit, so I didn't really, I don't know, like sit with it and check it out. So we will do that right now. We'll give ourselves a massive pour since we're sharing this. That can art's amazing, by the way. So yeah, uh, this is hazy. Um, it looks like juice. I don't know, half a finger of like an off-white kind of head. Small little bubbles everywhere. Let's see if we can generate some more head on that. Uh, no, I mean, it's fine. It looks awesome in the glass. It is. It's like half finger. It's like, a, I don't know, off-white head. But yeah, it's that just kind of orangey juice looking beer in the glass. Looks killer. So let's go ahead and shove our nose in it. Yeah, that's Citra. That's, I mean, it's oranges, it's tangerines. They're sweet, like tropical fruits in there. It's got a good amount of like this bready kind of crackery maltiness to it, <clears throat> which is really cool. Like it just, I always talk about that. It kind of balances the beer out. It's getting really windy. It was windy before, but it's, I think it's even more windy now. And there are kids yelling like, I think there's a pretty serious flag football game going on in the court below us. I don't know if you guys can hear that or not. Yeah, but this is like, it's got this cool grassy, like kind of herbaceous thing. This smells, it reminds me of like a West Coast style beer. Um, but the citra hops are there. I mean, it smells great. Again, though, it's I, I like the balance between beers that are just like total juice bombs and then, you know, like that West Coast kind of style beer. It's not West Coast-ish, but it's a balanced beer. It's not like this crazy over-the-top, like super juice bomb. I will say with like as hyped as this beer used to be, I don't know if it's like if the nose really lives up to what I thought it was gonna be. Um, and the same goes for the can that I had last week. So like, it's not an age thing. It's just not like crazy, crazy aromatic, but it smells fantastic. So let's go and taste it, Jordan. Cheers, thanks bro. Yeah, that, <laughs> that's so good. If you like citra hops, you will love this beer. Again, I think this is like three weeks to a month old. I love the amount of like, there. it's still really green. And when I say green, like kind of that herbaceous grassy kind of green. Um, and it just kind of balances with all the just, or it's like orange and orange peel. Middle of your tongue, it's got a good amount of bitterness. It just kind of sits there. Um, but it's, it's an awesome balance between like the juiciness of the hops and then like the bitterness of the hops, if that makes sense. You get a good amount of like orange, tangerine, kind of sweet citrus, even like sweet kind of ruby red grapefruit, like right up front. And then as it goes across your tongue, it just, it, the bitterness is there, it just kind of sits there. And then again, it just finishes with this awesome balance of, again, it's just like citrus fruits, citrus peel. Um, you get that good like green kind of herbaceous thing. And there's this sweet kind of bready, crackery, malty thing that just kind of, like it's a very balanced beer. 6.2%, really, really easy drinking. Um, I kind of wish this was a 16 ounce can because, I mean, I'm sharing this one 
and I just, it's so easy drinking, and it's only 6.2% that I don't think you're gonna get in a ton of trouble if you drink, excuse me, if you drink like a 16 ounce can of it. But I think this came in 12 ounce, six packs. I don't think it was four packs, it was, yeah, it was six packs. Um, I, like I said, I only got two cans of it in a trade, so. Um, I had mentioned before, this was like a bucket list beer for me whenever I saw people um, doing, or standing in line for Fuzzy Baby Ducks. I'm like, shit, I want it. I want that beer, I want that beer. I'm really, really glad I got to drink this. I don't know if it lived up to the hype that I put in my head just from like hearing what everyone was saying. And again, this beer has been around forever, so it's not like this kind of new wave, New England style juice bomb of a beer. I think you can tell this is an older recipe of a beer and I really, really appreciate it and I like that. Um, but I don't know, I guess, I'm kind of glad I didn't go crazy trying to trade for it years ago, if that makes sense. Really, really good though. I love how clean and how dry it finishes. Just makes it super, super easy, easy drinking. I love Citra Hop, so this is a really cool beer. Um, as far as the grade goes, probably like, I mean, if we're doing like a numeric score, like 92, 93, like in that A minus range, really, really good stuff. I love the artwork of the can. I love that I got to finally try this beer. So I'm super, super stoked on that. I just don't know, maybe I just built it up too much in my mind and maybe people will disagree with me, but um, still, it's an A beer. It's really, really good. So stoked that I got to try this. Maybe they'll package it in a different format and moving forward, if they do, I'd love to get my hands on some more cans of it. But that was Fuzzy Baby Ducks from New England Brewing Company. Awesome, awesome stuff. So if you guys have had it, leave a comment below. Let me know what you thought of it. Jordan, thanks so much for sharing this one. Uh, yeah, and I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. I will see you guys very soon. Cheers. Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse so I can bring bad news to all